Rain, shine, or snow. Every day is a good day for shooting. And that's what we're going to do today. Trying out the Thompson Center Compass. Just got it back from, well, replacement, not repair. But we're going to try out some factory American Eagle and some gold medal match um, cartridges. Yeah, I know. I got some comments saying that these are uh, pretty old. But here's a quick tip. If you got old cartridges such as this, pull the bullets, reseat them. That refreshes the bullet neck tension and removes that galvanic uh, corrosion that seems to hold the bullet and give you inconsistent neck tension or bullet tension, so to say. But that's what I did. I didn't do anything with the powder charge, just reseated the bullet. Um, and everything is back to factory spec. So at 100 yards, set zero. We'll see how this thing does and I'm pretty happy and pretty stoked that my shoulder gets a little bit of a break because of this bad boy. I've been shooting that uh, Mossberg ATR and I think kicks like a mule so I know this would be a lot softer shooter but let's get to it. Okay we'll see where this goes hopefully uh, I'm zeroed. Let me look down the bore, make sure somewhat near. Okay. Kind of bore sighted, so hopefully we'll see where this lands. Let's start out with a 150 grain American Eagle. Man, bolts tight. Ha, huh. first shot. And I'm almost dead set. Do another uh, three shot group. Let's go for the bottom left. All right, let's check out those groups. Who needs a laser bore sighter? Got eagle eyes. Just kidding. First shot, right on paper. Just using the bore, looking down the barrel, then lining up the scope. That's my trick. But on paper, I don't know if you can see that. Almost a three inch group. But reshot it and got two in one hole and then a WTF. So uh, we're gonna do a five shot group up here in the top left and see if it uh, improves. Starting to dump out here. All right, five shots. The barrel's not even warm. Cool. We'll go ahead and load up five shots of the gold medal match. These are 168 grains. Like I said, I uh, pulled the bullets and reseeded them exactly to uh, factory spec. And that should have fixed the galvanic corrosion and uniform the case neck. You know what? Let's just go for the center bullseye. One thing is the bolt is pretty hard to manipulate. Feels like it needs to be broken in a little bit.
All righty, let's go check those out. All right, here is the last five shots with a gold medal match. Uh, Federal premium, 168 grain. And get to see the focus. Uh, I don't know. Still not liking it. I don't know what happened here. Uh, I just keep on shooting, I guess. I'll try the 150s again. Aim for the top right. And then I did bring out some of my old hand loads. 180 grain Nosler uh, boat tail. That did some load development with the TC Compass previously. The old one. So let's go ahead and shoot a group here. And then I'll shoot these down there. Well, I don't know, Idaho. Just kidding, Idaho Rogers. <laughs> Let's go for five more. So I'm preloading the heck out of this bipod, so. I'm doing something wrong here. Someone pointed out. Bubble level straight. Scope and everything is nice and tight. Action screws are tight. I just checked it. So, all right. Man, son of a. Yep. My zero did walk on me. It's now hitting right. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Maybe five. Yeah, there's another, another little impression there. Okay, sub M away, and not right now. Get a little frustrated. Okay, I'm gonna try a shot there. 180 grain Nosler ballistic tips. Those folks that say it never rains in the desert. Well, there's proof. All right, give me something. I have no clue why the 308 is just kicking my butt. <clears throat> Ever since I got into the 308, it has made me a worse shooter. <laughs> Being the fact that I have spent lots of money in load development, not to mention buying two rifles. Should have got this in 6.5 Creedmoor. I think my son would have thoroughly enjoyed that cartridge a lot better. But, oh well, it is what it is. This is what I got. Let me get this done before I turn into a soggy dumpling. Yeah, that's an Asian joke. All right. Uh, bottom right. I'm done. It's getting too wet out here. Let's go check out that target. Hey, check that out. My 180 grain nozzlers are working. Hmm. It's better than factory ammunition. What's going on there? Huh? Huh? Hand loading. Yeah. Anyways, it's dumping out here. As you can tell. Rain or shine? Hold on. Rain or shine, I'm gonna get out here and shoot. What's your guys' excuse? Nut up, right? I'm just kidding. I love ya. Oh, another raindrop. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna cut this short. Thanks for watching. Here's an update on the TC Compass. <coughs> I think I'm getting sick. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Nut up.